love Barbie. The cast is yeah. incredible. The costumes are insane. The album's brilliant. Like, what, what could go wrong? <laughs> She's cute. She wears pink. She is friendly, lively, bubbly. The friend she makes. And just everything. Barbie's everything, literally. Well, there's not a corner of the globe uh, that hasn't turned pink. Uh, and it's not pink core, it's Barbie core. Uh, and we take a lot of pride in the fact that our color is obviously synonymous uh, with a big movement right now. And there's not a category out there that we haven't carefully curated uh, as an opportunity for everyone to play with Barbie. strategy was here was this is Barbie's world and we're living in it and they've done a really good job at this and that's what just marketing is all about it's just bringing stuff to life and making people aware of it. I think what they've done here is trying to make Barbie culturally relevant again. Bring it to life, make it uh, a piece that not, it's just not about nostalgia, not about toys, but really a universe that you can really feel, touch and feel a part of, right? Mattel is really trying to redefine themselves as not just a toy brand anymore, but as someone who kind of plays into culture. Like, they've done really well uh, selling to older generations, younger generations, but now that everything's kind of moved past that into like a digital world, how do you kind of reach people where they are, right? It's the things that they own, the things they experience, and that's what they're trying to start with Barbie. 